YouTube. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my tongue journal. Tongue. <laughs> oh my God. Today has been not a very good day. A lot of tears. A lot of why me? <laughs> I could not go back to crafting. And really, I decided I have to. I just have to. Otherwise, I'm not going to stop feeling bad about myself. Everything has dried a long time ago. Everything I prepared. So, all good. All ready. Waiting for me, you know, to use it. Uh, I need to cut up something of the leaf. Okay. So, I better start using it, right? I want to finish the page. It's not much left for the page. I was just waiting for this stuff to dry, actually, so I can put it right. Oh, I apologize for moaning or whatever <laughs> there will be. I don't know. I'm just hurting. My fingers feel like those are not mine. I'm telling you. How come you can feel pain in your fingers, but you cannot feel what you're doing? That's very interesting. So this is how it's going to go. Looking at this right now, I am thinking, do I need something else? Do I need more on that? Or what? What should I do? I do have this little flower still left over. I used one right here. I'm just going to see. So nothing, you know. I don't think I want to put more flowers on top of that. But I wonder if I should put more flowers like right here. Maybe like a little, you know, cluster. I don't know. My fingers just don't want to work. Jesus. I know some of you might think, why would you start the video then? But I really need to do something to get out of all of the crying. So I need to do something. And since I started the series, I don't want you guys to miss what I was doing. Because some of you are interested in that. <laughs> I know, I know. It's very surprising that you are. But I'm thinking about maybe doing that. Or, and I'm going to use, why were they stuck? Glue came onto them. Oh my God, they are so dirty. Okay. Everything is going to be slower in this video. So you could actually just, you know, move forward. I don't know if putting them on that or putting them on here has a better effect. <laughs> I wish somebody could help me out sometimes. Okay, I do kind of like them on there, but then again, I, I, I wonder if that's too much flowers. You know what? Let me stick the greenery down first before I do anything else. And I'm going to do this with my tweezers. Just because my fingers right now are not the best. I'm sorry that this video is so depressing. I feel like we're two minutes in or something and it's depressing already. Okay, so I definitely want this to go a little bit over the picture. Like maybe like this. Okay, like this. I think that's the best spot. So I'm just going to glue right here, right there. What am I using? Um, let me use the art glitter glue for this one. I hope it is going to stick. I'm not sure about that. It will stick onto the paper part for sure. So let's see if it's going to stick everywhere. Oh man. Okay. Okay. I did put my the needle top for this onto my wish list wish wish list on Amazon. So we'll see. Maybe next time when I have a little bit 
of time and leftover money, I will get myself... <gasps> oh, that was so bad. It's okay, I'm going to... Uh, see, I can't even hold my tweezers. Girl! <laughs> That's upsetting. You know, I really want to... Let me clean you, dear lady. I really feel like turning off the cam because this is going to be a disaster. It feels like it's going to be a disaster just because I'm not able to work. You see, that's my problem with going to work, work, you know, that's why I cannot work. Because I cannot function every day, all day long. It's just not possible. And I am yet to find a job where, you know, somebody would think, oh, it's all right. You can't function today. Just come back tomorrow. <laughs> you know, even um, like jobs from home, you have a certain volume you have to do right but this can take me a day to get better an hour five minutes a week two weeks it's it depends you know i don't know how long i will need to get better so it's hard but i found youtube and youtube is my job now i try to convince myself that this is my job because not having a job and not being able to kind of help support the family has been a really, really bad point in my life. I don't know. It That upsets me a lot. Okay. How do I like it? Now I need to find the position of the flowers. The one I like. <laughs> I don't know. I think, I think I'm going to go like that. That's the best. And here I will use the silicon glue. I know, using all different glues for all different kinds of stuff. <sighs> However, guys, I have had people making fun of people who can't work, you know, or just saying that those people are failures or lazy or anything which i you know when i'm having a bad day i will just play right into it i will consider myself a failure and lazy and everything else you know so i will believe those people who say that and i will say that to myself as well that you know my worth is nothing because I'm not really a member of society like <laughs> I'm not a member of society at all <laughs> if you look at that I'm not I'm not going out I'm not doing stuff I'm not meeting family I'm I don't know I barely go to stores I go to Tuesday morning I'm a member of Tuesday morning society <laughs> once a week <laughs> once a week and going to Tuesday morning once a week kills me for two days so there's that, right? <laughs> have to have to decide what you like to do and if you are willing to pay for it for the next two days or whatever. I'm not sure about the flowers on this. I'm really not. One piece of me wants them there and the other piece of me doesn't. I think it's gonna be too much. And they don't go with those flowers at all. They do go with these, though. But I think we are okay just like that. I think that turned out really good. I do like that. I have to hold this longer because the silicon glue takes a while to dry. So I'm just going to put that away. Didn't, don't get lost and I will post the video just for two minutes or so and I will just hold here because I don't think you want to watch me holding this for two minutes okay so that's on there 
more or less. And I've been using this glue for quite a while now, and I'm not down to half of it, so I'm good. I like that. I was thinking, oh my God, for how long, how long will this last? So, very bulky book. I have no idea what I'm gonna do here because it's super bulky. You know, it's never gonna be flat. And if I make like another cover for that, I really don't know how to glue this cover in. I was thinking about making, you know, like if you if you take a box, like a uh, cereal box, you know, if you cut one side off right here, let's say this is the cereal box, you cut off this piece and then you get like, you can open it, it's like a book. I would use this for a cover, but I would not know how to stick this in there. Because if I, do I just stick it on that? part but then it's still bulky in the cover i don't know if you have any ideas please let me know so i can look into that Oop. it got stuck there a little bit i don't know why okay now let me see here you know what i was thinking because i have those envelopes i was just going to see if they would be anything good in my journal. I got them from Tuesday morning. They are so pretty. Look, you always get two of a design. So I was wondering if I should stick one in here. You know, like on the last page where you can um, actually keep your stuff whatever if you have something you wanted to put into the journal later you could um, put just in here it has the second side which says notes which I was actually thinking about cutting out but <laughs> then again <laughs> I was thinking I have to glue it down anyway so you know nobody's gonna see this part it also has this uh, perforation right here let me see I don't think it goes into the bag but if it does, yes, it does. You can just cover this up, or I could just cover this up with a piece of washi and it would be done right away. But I'm really considering putting this in the back just for, you know, sometimes you write something and you could put it in there and then keep it in there. And I did take out a bunch of envelopes actually and things because I wanted to go through it and see where I could use some because <coughs> I want this to be able to serve as a journal not just a book to look at because there's a lot of work that I put in there and I want this to be useful if it makes any sense so I also have those from so I think so so you know I was thinking about putting like a piece of paper in there so you can journal and then stick it in here but I need to actually just distress it and do something with that because otherwise it won't work and I will just start with that so today there will probably or surely not be a new page all i'm gonna do today is just look for some envelope spots and some papers i want to use in there you know because i think we are kind of getting to the end of my book slowly but surely where is my because i'm so smart now see it's good to have friends who tell you what to do yeah slowly but surely we are getting we're going towards the end i really thought i'm gonna do like 100 episodes because there's 100 pages in the book <laughs> but <clears throat> it seems to work out better well even holding this thing is seriously like a huge job for me right now And I think I'm not going to do anything else to it. Just distress it a little bit because I think it's actually perfect. It's very pretty. It has pinks, which is good, but they are not very bright pinks. They more, 
muted and um, when I distress it I think it's gonna look better it has some gold in the middle it says something it says merci beaucoup so I might I could I could put something different on it but I might just leave it like that I think I want more of the distress ink. I want less of the white color to be on the envelope. Just because nothing is white in my book. So not too much, just to mute it a little bit. See, this is much brighter right here. And I will do the same thing right here. Okay, looks good to me. Now we need some blue, and I must say, I'm not sure where I put my my blue I was using. So I'm just going to go with a new blue. And this one is Peacock Feathers, and I do have a pen in this colors in this color and I love it so I'm assuming that I'm going to love this one too and I really do it's a really pretty color Ooh, I like that and I also like the combination of blue this kind of blue the pink and the brown I think it gives it something special and I'm just going to randomly go I go over the edges and then I randomly go over the envelope a little bit okay look it's just more distrust I would say and I need a piece of coffee dyed paper, so it's possible to actually, well, let me see, no, this one is printed on, I can't put this one in there. I have a new stack, so I need to dye, coffee dye some more. Ooh, you know what? I don't know, let me see. And then putting something on top. No, I don't like that. But I could put something like that. Hmm, well, let me do that too. Let me just trust this one a little bit. It's coffee dyed paper. I um, actually cut to a doily with the dye. It doesn't look like a doily. It's more like a circle with something. <laughs> Not really, not really a doily, but it's round, it's pretty, so it's useful. Just with the edges to get darker. Can we do that? Let me, let me turn this. Oh yeah, we can do that much better just by turning this thing. <laughs> Now we'll go through here. I still want the coffee be visible, of course. Okay, now I'm going to cut this piece of paper. Oh my God, I just cleaned the left side of my table, right? I just told you. And it's all messed up again. How long are they? 11, five and a half, kind of. Let's do this. Okay. Do this and I'm going to put one piece in there now I'm thinking if it's possible probably not okay I'm gonna get a stamp I did write myself actually a couple things here it's a big flower 
<laughs> okay. I um, wrote it down to just look through what I have. And I wrote it down right here. And I will just get something. Okay, so there we go. And I want to do it on this one. Just because if it gets something from the back, I think it would be really cool. And I want to stamp something on the top. Because this is going to be like a little letter which can be written to yourself i <laughs> that's the only block i have here oh goodness okay yeah if i could only hold it in my hands today nothing wants to stay in my hands today it doesn't have to be straight in the middle perfect or anything at all it says enjoy every moment here and now right away when I get my stamps I get my cleaning pad that's so cool <laughs> advertisement again <laughs> it's all for free guys it's all for free and I would love to stamp a little bird on the bottom. And I'm sorry that I'm so slow. It's really hard. But I'm trying my best. It's just a little bird from, from a stamp set. I wonder where I want to stamp it. I'm just going to go right here. Oh, it looks so good. Look, you can just write something to yourself. And it has a little birdie right here. And then I will just fold this. Oh my God. It even, you know, is the right <laughs> length and everything. To fit into the envelope. Love that. Now, let's close the envelope. Let's get my little napkin. And now I would like to put something else on top, but I would not know what. What do you think should go on top? I mean, I will put like a paper clip or something on top, but I feel like there should be something else as well. Let's see. Look what I got here. I got a little bit. Ooh, it's even gold. You see that? You see that? It's just as gold as the piece in the middle. Wait, I want to see something. Okay, so what if I can staple it to this one and then just close? Oh, and you know, put this in the back and then this stays on there forever. I think that's just a good idea. I'm going to do it with the little one from Tim Holtz, my, I don't know, my tiny toucher, <laughs> tiny toucher. <laughs> what is it called? I think it's called tiny toucher. I don't know if it's going to go all the way though. Oh, it does. Oh, it does. Okay, let's attach this. Ah, <gasps> good. Look. Look, it, <laughs> it looks like up here. I think it's pretty good. It's really cool. I know when I stick it in, it's going to be a little bit harder, but who cares? Or I could just... Let me see. I'm just trying to put it inside of the envelope. You know what? Wait. I think I need to fold the letter a tiny bit different. So it just sticks better in there. Okay. 
And now flip this over. I'm just putting this inside of the bag. Now it stays there and when, once I push it into my booklet, it doesn't go off all the time. You know what I mean? I think that looks good. Okay, do we need those? We might need those stamps. I will just keep them right here for now. Let's see. One more booklet. Yep, not bad. Because I will have more gold. This one has gold on the sides and I will have more gold into my booklet, in my booklet. Okay, this. Then I do have the two journaling pages. I did put a piece of paper to journal on right here. <clears throat> Let me see. What kind of card do I have in here? Because I do have, I know I do have a journaling card somewhere here. <coughs> Excuse me, guys, I'm sorry. Let me look for it. Okay, so I knew I have one, and I do have one right here. And I'm just going off cam, because I have my booklet here, and I don't want to move stuff. I will just do what I did for the past 20 episodes. I will destroy the edge just a little. Okay. Okay. I will have to move the booklet anyways because I do have to. I do have to. Oh, distress this. I can't distress this. It's just a little journaling card. It says journal and date. So the date can be put in. And it is black and white because. I printed it twice and the first time I didn't know that my phone is set up to printing black and white but that's totally fine because I'm going to go with my distress ink around everything anyways so and here you can also write something on the back of the card which I think is absolutely cool I really, really want this to be useful, you know. Being able to write on it is one big use. And what I want to do is wherever the bird is, I will just go like that. That's just like a huge mass but i like it i want to kind of give the color to the bird like the bird is black and white and i don't like that and i want just to have this huge color right there and then the rest of it is whatever it turns out to be my art my book I want a huge spot of color right there. Oh, my back. Okay. And now I will even go here and just trust this side as well. So I do like that. Maybe even here. Okay. So I do have another journaling card to put in here. Oh gee. There is my little letter. There is my little journaling card. More to journal. Right here I need another piece. And I'm going to look for something that is bigger and sturdier. So here I will make, need to make something different for this part. Did I want to go around the edges here anyways? I don't know. 
I'm not sure. Oh no, because this one is here. Okay, so never mind. Then. This one needs a tiny bit of color because it's too dark. And I also want to stamp something on this one. I do have a little corner stamp right here, but I'm thinking about stamping something different as well. Maybe like here or there. I'm not sure. Let me see. Okay, while I was looking for the stamp, I realized how late it is and that I do have to take care of the dogs first or at least tell Michelle to help me out with that. Um, I will finish here. It has been like half an hour or something. So I will finish here for now. And um, I hope you enjoyed it anyways, even though I'm just like finishing up or having the finish up touches and putting stuff here and there. So nothing very special, but I hope you enjoyed it anyways. This is how this page turned out. And I think this is just really good. I don't think I wanted to put anything else on there. Everything is stuck. This one is looking out. So I want to make more on the sides. That's what I want to work on as well next time. We'll see how far I come. I wonder if the glitter that's on here where this came from. Because I don't have any glitter like this in my shaker. Okay, however... I hope you enjoyed this, and if you did, give me a thumbs up, share, subscribe, leave me a comment. And um, yeah, this page needs to be done too, because I need something in the back. Otherwise, it's just going to do that. I mean, I could close it like, surprise, <laughs> but you know what I mean, right? Okay, like I said, thumbs up, share, subscribe, leave me a comment, and enjoy your day. I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.